What you're seeing is the Gas Micro Air Vehicle, or GMAV. The RQ-16 T-Hawk is an unarmed, short-range, vertical takeoff and landing remotely piloted aircraft that allows personnel to get a close look in situations where it would normally be too hazardous to do so. The T-Hawk's small footprint allows it to be carried inside the vehicle, ready for starting and launch. The exposure to the operator can be minimized. The T-Hawk can be completely controlled from inside the vehicle. T-Hawk can maneuver close over suspected IEDs and hover to provide a detailed examination while keeping operators at a safe distance. Bomb disposal units use them to scout for roadside bombs in combat theaters. Police SWAT teams use them to gather intelligence in hostage situations. After the 2011 earthquake and tsunami in Japan, U.S. military personnel used a T-Hawk to acquire the first clear images of the damaged nuclear containment structures of the Fukushima Daiichi power plant. At the time, radiation levels were too high to allow people or other types of aircraft to safely approach. GMAV brings more of a hovering capability, whereas the Raven I would continu continuously have to bank left or right to find a target. With the GMAV I can just go right up on the target, uh, like is in the, the factory mission we had about three months ago. I could hover the bird right in front of the, my troops going backwards as I'm looking at the phase line in front of us. So I can tell my guys, hey, on the other side of the building, this, is, this guy is going into it. It's, it's very rewarding just, to, just flying around for the Army and then uh, saving lives, basically. 